uh, I kind of was trying to prepare for what are the what are the highlights of this past year and what are yeah. what are we facing in the coming year? Uh-huh. And I have to tell you that the quarry and the first battle in the spring versus the quarry today and what's coming, you know they've applied for a permit with ADM. Uh, okay, so 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 Creekwood has went ahead and put in for another permit for up there around Beulah. Put in for a permit up in the Beulah community. Right. Okay. I, I'd been tracking it, but I hadn't looked in a couple of weeks. So yeah. Yeah that's going to be our big issue for the next several months right right you know roger what else do you see coming this this coming year <sighs> you know just um obviously the quarry is going to take up a good bit of it and still you know dealing with the pandemic as far as you know moving forward obviously you know the, the vaccine starting to go out we have uh, first responders now you know getting that vaccine so uh, yeah, main thing is just trying to hopefully we'll be winding down, you know, from the pandemic this upcoming year, which would be very helpful. Um, get back to some sort of what we had before. I don't think we'll go back completely, but at least right. you know, we'll move forward with that. You know, as far as uh, other than that, the only real big thing we have on on tap as far as a project is expanding and remodeling the EMA uh, facility, uh, and hopefully we'll get that project bidded and started. Yeah. Uh, this upcoming uh, spring uh, and some more recreation also. We're probably uh, we're trying yeah. to get uh, uh, Beauregard finished up uh, and then try to get concession restrooms at both Beauregard and Beulah. So I'd, I'd say those are the two main capital projects I see for the upcoming year. 